What's up YouTube? This is Collect Pokemon and today we are going to have another unboxing video. Um, this one is quite interesting because I've actually unboxed the international version of this box. <clears throat> so let's just zoom out a little. Tilt the camera angle. So this is the Sama Santa. So uh, <clears throat> let's move that so I can actually so we can actually see the name. This is a Sama Santa Elite Trainer Box Plus. This is so called the international version. We can see from this box here, it actually says Elite Trainer Box Plus Sama Santa. This is equivalent to our Ultra Premium Sassian and Sama Santa box, and yeah, that's pretty cool. Basically, it's gonna have the same thing, but it's just gonna cut the box in half. Here we have half the box, and I do feel like this Elite Trainer Box is longer than the one that we're used to. So I'm just gonna grab a. <clears throat> like a random elite trainer box and just to compare the size so we can actually see that this elite trainer box is a little longer than the original elite trainer box and so um i guess that's what makes it plus you know that little like two centimeter kind of thing so yeah without further ado we're actually going to open this and we also have the other version which is the sassian version right here <clears throat> so this makes up the uh Ultra Premium Collection Box. Uh, we're going to open it and see if the cards are any better. Or are, are they better quality and things. And yeah, let's going to take a look at what's in here. Right. A little difficult to open, I would think. So apparently, this international version has been delayed and delayed and delayed. Um, so we're waiting on the news for the Ultra Premium Collection, which is the... Uh, ones with the both Sama Santa and the Sassian in it. So we've opened it before and I did tell people that I do not recommend buying this because um, I mean you can buy one or two for seal but definitely not anymore. I mean just don't hold on to more of these. It looks really cool. I mean it's very very artsy and stuff with all these kind of things. And I'm just gonna go mute my computer because it's a little loud. So basically, we get the same booklet again. So this booklet is obviously showing us the cards and, you know, that famous page where it has delivery Charizard. So, uh, where did it go? So yeah, that's delivery Charizard that, you know, we're looking at. So, something cool, something not bad. So we're going to open the Summer Santa first. This one weights quite heavy as well. Ooh, knocking on the camera. Just like the Elite Trainer Box, inside we actually have, let's just focus, has these kind of sleeve, I mean these kind of cardboard to stop it from pretty much moving around. Some of these card box are really broken up already. So um, before we do that, we're actually just going to... Oh, and they actually did quite a good job because these guys, these coins, are actually really, really heavy. So they made a really good job enforcing it, so it doesn't hit onto the cards. So these ones are actually still intact in the back. The other one we opened was that it wasn't intact. So I'm just going to pull this out. Oh, That's not going to be easy. Wait a second. I want to get the promo card out without damaging it. But it's actually very difficult, so I'm just going to pull the promo card out first. This one actually looks. This one actually looks a lot better than the uh, international version. I might be able to actually grade this. So, so having issue. You guys can see it's soup. What is this? It's so hard to pull out, dude. Yeah, when you guys are pulling these out, you know it's a very very tight fit. Apparently, there is, instead of the regular 8 or 10 booster packs, we have 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We have 12 booster packs, and we have our sleeve, which actually, I didn't really realize. This one, the inside is gold? I don't recall it being gold in the uh, international version. Let me, let, me just, let me just go and check. Sorry, guys. I know I've been running around. I don't recall seeing the sleeve being this color. Uh, let me just check. Might be up. Oh, it is the same color. 
Sorry, I just never turned this leaf over. Okay, now we know it's the same. Okay. Right, so, like I said, the Elite Trainer box, let me just zoom out a little bit more. We can see that it's a much longer box than the original Elite Trainer box. Okay, we have half the Summer Sensor there. And theoretically, this should kind of fit right back in. Come on, fit right back in. Yep, and this would make a quite a nice uh, box. And on this side, we have that. I just feel like the um, the uh, American version, the ultra premium one, feels more premium. But the texture on the box, it actually feels quite quite similar to those inner boxes that we had. So not bad. I mean, that's done pretty well, I think. So uh, good job, Pokemon. The card, the promotional card, is actually good looking. So uh, I'm I'm gonna. I'm gonna cut it open, but I'm gonna get some sleep first. Sorry, I was just not prepared for this opening, so uh, bear with me, guys. Bear with me. Alright. Perfect. Alright, so let's get some uh, custom made sleeve, and then we're gonna cut this open, which I realize I have nowhere to cut this but here. Okay, so. Cut this a little better so I don't damage the card. How does this look, guys? I think this looks a lot better. Right? Beautiful looking card. Now we're going to take a look at the back. Centering is an issue, but I think we might be able to sneak through it. I think that's still fine. So, not bad. This one is actually uh, quite good, in my opinion. Trust me, I've been opening a little... some of these, and some of them are just horrible. Right, so that is the... And I better move these coins before I smash that card. That was the Sassian box. No, that was the Sama Santa box. Now let's get into the Sassian box to see if we can actually see the same thing. So here's the Sassian box. Beautiful looking box. Oop, let's cut into it. Ooh. I'm actually quite surprised they actually came out very differently from the US and also uh, the international version. But overall, I think it's definitely cool to open different products from different regions on the channel. So beautiful, Sassian box. Okay. It actually looks really good when it's kind of like stacked up like that. But once you open it, you know, again, inside looks, smells very fresh. And let's see if there's any broken bags. Nope, we have the Sama Santa coin, the Sassian coin, sorry. The heavier, well, it's not the heavier, but the uh, golden color dice. We get extra thing. In the other box, in the big box, we only get one set of this, but here we get two sets of this because technically it's two box. We have a little booklet, trainer and rules, which you you know you usually just chuck away. So now that I've learned how to wait, where's the promo card? Oh wow, this one this promo card might actually be damaged. We'll see. We will see kind of slide in a very awkward position, the Sassian. Is it damaged? So far, so good. Sorry, guys. Looks okay. I mean, it's not the best. It's not as good as the Samazenta, but I think it looks okay. So we're just going to cut this open and sleeve this first. Right, let's leave this. So you guys can help me judge. So the centering on this one, I think is slightly better than this MSN one. So I'll see it. Beautiful card. Now let's take a look at the back. I think this promo card looks a lot better. The corners are 
are much better looking, less damaged. And I think it's because that the card was actually held in place by the cardboard, unlike the uh, the Ultra Premium Collection box, which the card was actually just kind of there, sliding around. So I think that is the difference. And I think, you know, they should really learn how to better pack these cards. So beautiful, beautiful, two beautiful dogs. Uh, we're going to get into the packs. Yeah, it's quite late right now, so... Um, you guys can see me a little drained and tired. Right. So again, we have 12 more packs on this side. So we're going to open it. Uh, let's start off with the boring stuff at the back first. Right. Oh, opening Pokemon card. Haven't done this for a while. Ooh, it's really stuff. Stiff. Okay, some code card for you guys. Oh, I should really go into the... Uh, I should zoom in the camera. Since we're now opening cards, we could actually move it in. More sword and shield. Let's see if I can actually... Ooh, white code. It's fancy. Oh, it is a hollow rare. Nothing there. Okay, sword and shields are packed. There should be four base sword and shield packs. So we're gonna see. Ooh, white coat. That's for you guys. Oh, we've got something. Stone, stone, stone journal. Okay, rebel clash. So we're just gonna open all the non-essential packs first. Green coat. Right. Reverse. Pretty much that. Right. Let's see what we're going to pull. Green code. Nothing. Don't worry. I don't mind not pulling anything on the Rebel Clash packs. I want to pull... Let's see if we can pull some amazing rare. Or even a Pikachu. Rebel Clash. Boss order? No. I wish. So let's go into Darkness of Blaze. Charizard. Huh. Is this a sign? Let's see what we're gonna get. Oop, okay. Oh, Vega Vote. Nice, this is a full art. The, uh, I think this is an alternative full art. Yeah. Because the regular one is just the V. But any full art V, it's like a, yeah. So what else are we gonna get? I hope I press the record button. I should be recording. Yeah, that's fine. That's, that would be really silly of me. If I've opened everything, I realize I haven't actually pressed the record button. Okay, white code. This is... This is... This is a Blaziken. Let's get into Vivid Voltage. Box number... Pack number two. See? After you do so much box opening. That's what you get. Right, so uh, yeah, by the way, uh, if you guys want, oh, oh, nice, isn't that nice? Jirachi, amazing rare. So, I was saying that you know, if you guys haven't done so, uh, hit the like, hit the subscribe button because we'll be opening a lot of new chap and new Pokemon products in general. Not bad, not bad. And I think that we have what do you call it? Um, the Tag Team All-Star. So those would be, uh, breaks will be available um, on the website. So you guys can check it out in the link description below. So this is fun. Last pack, Vivid Voltage in our first box. Green code. Oh, reverse. There's no amazing rare here. Right, then we jumped into our, I think that, that, that one was a saucy box. This is the Summer Santa one. Let's see if we can pull something. So, in these boxes, each box has 12 packs, unlike the Ultra Premium, which in one box, there's 16 packs, I think. But I mean, I mean, yeah. So that's why I think this is a bit more expensive, more pricier than the Ultra Premium. Oh, <laughs> really good at pulling this guy. Stone Journal, VMAX. Rebel? Oh, not Rebel yet. 
Okay. So I, initially, I was thinking to break this up into two videos. One on the Summit Center and one on the Sassin. And I was like, eh, might as well. I just I should just open both of them on the same video. Alright. Nothing there. Okay, are we in Rebel number two? I think there's three packs. Because I'm moving a lot, the focus is really annoying. Let me just try and lock the focus. Yep. So I think I locked the fo Ooh, okay, another in in Litin Intelin Emax. Never pronounce some of these names. Rebel Clash. Pack number three. Right. Green code. Okay, nothing there. Okay, Darkness of Blaze. Charizard, come on guys. Charizard. Give me a Charizard. Actually, I want Pikachu more than the Charizard, but I would take the Charizard. Right, let's see. So I'm, I'm happy with the Jirachi. I mean, pulling a Jirachi Amazing Rare, that's cool enough. That's cool enough for me. Oh my god, what is that? Okay, Grimstar V Max. Not bad. Hits are quite good. At least it's not like the other time when I pretty much pulled nothing. That was so unfortunate. Oh, white coat again. Oh, what is this? What is this? What is this? Okay, Hondun V. Wow. Vivid Voltage. Three packs. Is there another amazing mare? It might be. These packs are hot. Green coat. Oh, that's a reverse. <laughs> I was like, wait, is someone stuck? But apparently it's not. Pivot number two. Okay. Reverse. Alchemy. Vivid number three. This is the Pikachu. Come on, fat Pikachu. You must be in there. It is a green card. All right. That pretty much ends our opening. But honestly, it's not bad. I mean, we pulled like Jirachi, amazing rare. So we'll let the autofocus does it. And then we have our Sassian and some Asenta. These ones are very clean. These ones are very clean version of these cards. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, uh, thank you for tuning in to this opening. I'll catch you guys in the next one. This is Collect Pokemon. Peace.